Hi guys, welcome to this video about what you can do when you're stuck in uninstalling or reinstalling a software. I had this a couple of days ago and I tried to remove um, the PDF24. That's really good software. Maybe I'll cover that in another video. Uh, it's a free PDF like editing or let's say manipulating software and what i did uh, i mean i needed a new version so uh what i what, what you sometimes do is you just download the new version and then it should update um the old installation and you shouldn't have any problems so far and that i did and di it didn't work it brought up uh, an error so I, I thought yeah okay maybe it's it's safe when i just uninstall the old version for me so i went to the settings you go to settings you can you have this apps thing here and yeah, it's a little bit slow at the moment so you can search this list and say let's say we have some Canon software. Why isn't it accepting my writing? Doesn't do that. I had this some time ago already. Probably the system is a little bit slow. I have to wait. So now it's accepting my writing. Let's say we have this Canon yeah, we want to install something from Canon, let's say the network tool, and then we click, we left click on that, and we say uninstall, and usually would expect that it's doing an uninstall properly. But what happened, I had a special version of an antivirus, or it was more like an uh, anti-ransomware software and it blocked the uninstallation. I never had this before. For some reason, the anti-ransomware software decided to block that and it was really stuck. I, there was no, no, no way, not even with the uh, task manager, I, I wasn't able to uh, shut down this process. The only thing was to shut down the whole system or to to reboot the whole windows 10 system so i thought yeah probably the uninstallation has been working and then i tried to i, I downloaded the new version and clicked on install and i had exactly same problem again it was running like uh working for about 75 percent installation was really almost done and then it got stuck and absolutely same thing as as with the installation uh, with the uninstallation same thing with the installation it was totally stuck no help with the uh, task manager nothing no way to yeah uh, install it so i was stuck i couldn't remove it really i could not install it again when i went here to the apps manager apps and features the software installation was gone so there was no way to look for the pdf24 and try to uninstall again because it was mostly uninstalled um yeah that was bad situation so i thought yeah what can i do so what i decided then to do hold on a second um yeah so here we have the PC. So what I did then, I tried to clean everything. This is really important. So I tried to clean all the information, all the all the things which are on all the drives. So I have like a C drive where is window, Windows, and I had a D drive where there is more like the uh, program files. So if you have everything on C, you do, you just have to do it once so i had to do it twice so i clicked on c where my windows is and wrote pdf24 let's say here we have canon and then it's looking for every canon thing and especially what's important if you have really folders you have to look for folders 
so I'm changing the view I change the view for details and then you can find folders of course you have to be careful not delete silly things yeah this is a Windows Canon URL you uh, yeah probably something like this I wouldn't delete but there was um, two there were two folders remaining the, really the program folder like C program files Canon I mean that was uh, the of course the PDF 24 but here in this case it would be like C um, backslash program files backslash Canon so you I clicked on that and press the lead button and it was gone and the other thing I had was the user uh, settings when you have like something which is called uh, user local can't remember how, how it's called so local files um, user um, um, yeah something like that and there was also a uh, PDF 24 folder and that I deleted so um, yeah here in this case I don't see this it's a little bit slow maybe it would come up in a couple of minutes so I wouldn't delete such detailed things maybe if you find the right folder these things would go away anyway you can check the folders here in which folders it is doesn't look for me like something I would delete this is in the C windows okay that's windows old I don't need this any anyway but um, especially when it's in C and C windows I definitely wouldn't delete that within there so I would just when it's program program files and then the program name or user and then everything which is under user user these um, roaming profiles or local uh, profiles all these things I would remove from every drive so I go out of this thing uh, yeah so delete every local folder which is not in the Windows system file but yeah program files and user files and then which is also very important you have to clean the registry I decided to download this thing from chipde I always recommend using this site even when it's in German but you can uh, search for your program file and then space and chip dot de and you will get to this installation file and always use manual installation here never use download the um, the installation helper always use the original file which is the manual installation here click on that download install and yeah I use this uh, registry cleaner and it brought up about 200 errors a lot of errors like a lot of references to old folders old programs old really old stuff and that is confusing uh, the whole system it's slowing down everything and it could prevent uh, our installation and reinstallation so I just clicked on fast automatic clean and it took me some I don't know can't remember it, it, it took some time to analyze everything but uh, cleaning then was uh, really just a couple of seconds and after these two things deleting the local files and cleaning the registry I rebooted my computer and then I tried to reinstall my PDF 24 and it worked right away so that is what I really can recommend I never had such a situation before I was really stuck and I didn't know where to find help so I just was looking for to find my own way and it seemed to work so I hope it will work for you too just yeah um, if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time